Alrighty, folks. Holy shit. Holy shit. We haven't been live for a very long time. What's up, guys? My name is Alex, obviously, and welcome back to a new live stream. And I'm so excited to do this because in this live stream, guys, I will be showing you guys lots of stuff that you guys can request live. So make sure to go ahead and leave all your uh, suggestions in the chat and we'll get it rolling so first of all I'm gonna wait until a few more people have tuned in so we're gonna go ahead and add in the fade in then we're gonna go over to transitions and we're gonna scroll all the way down until we see iris uh, which is this one and then we're gonna pick the template circle out white border so I'm gonna look for it and let's see where it is circle out white border we're gonna drag that on top of um, the, the 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 shooting footage obviously as you can see but then like I said in the video um, if I play back this video you just see a white line and we want to change that to water so it's gonna be pretty straightforward so what we're gonna do then is we're gonna go to the compositing mode right here we're gonna put that one to custom and then this menu is popping up and what we're gonna do then is we're gonna pick Vegas height map we're gonna click on add click on OK and if you play back the video as you can see Boom! That looks freaking tight, as you can see. Let's see if I can put the preview a little less. So it, ha it has a little bit less lag in it. Boom! As you can see, that is how you actually do it. So, also what you want to do is the X, uh, I mean the edge uh, pixel handling. Put that one to wrap pixels around. And then the last thing you need to do is check alpha channel, uh, this guy, just the middle one. And then if we can just go ahead and add in a fade out so we can go back to the footage. If I play back the video, this is what it looks like. As you can see, it adds a nice water ripple effect. And that's how amazing it looks, guys. I'll just loop it for you guys uh, just a, a couple of times. So this is basically <clears throat> how to actually create the awesome ripple effect. I hope you guys enjoyed this topic. Thank you for the person that has requested. I think it was William in uh, all the capital letters. So, um, yeah. That's basically the water ripple effect. Freaking amazing effect. You can you can use this, uh, use this rather in gameplay uh, videos, in anything, in, in just anything you can imagine. Can you read the comments, please? Yes, I'm doing, but it's 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 pretty uh, it's moving pretty quickly, so I gotta keep up. Just wondering how well did you first few tutorials do, and did they get popular when you uploaded them? No, um, I don't know. I can I can look through my analytics like. Um, how they how they did the first uh, the first time but I cannot go into my analytics because my earnings will show and then my network will kick my ass for showing it so but to answer your question simply they did not get a lot of views um, at first it, it, it they had to be discovered so it's not like I uploaded them boom 2,000 views in a day no I was like I was happy when I had thousand views in a, in a month so then it growed it growed I started making more they get more views and that's how it 
kind of blew up. Wait a minute, wait a minute, guys. We have another super chat from Flashy Mike again. Here is another five dollars because the donating link would not work for me. Get that new monitor, man. You deserve it. Dude, thanks again, uh, Flashy Mike. I think it is. Guys, hype in the chat. Hype in the chat from Flashy Mike. Another five dollar super chat. Thanks a lot, dude. Well appreciated. And also, make sure to smash the like button down below. Because we're approaching 100 likes, that would be awesome. Please show how to split screen and play two videos at the same time. That's a good one. Okay, we're gonna go to um, well, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna use two pictures, but you want to imagine that those are two videos of yourself. So of anything else, so I'm gonna go to media generators. I'm gonna click on the uh, solid color for now. And I'm going to pick the color red. And I'm gonna pick the color blue. So. Let's pretend that those two clips, uh, the blue and the red, are your videos. What you want to do is it's pretty simple. You want to click on the uh, event pen crop icon right there. What you want to do then is you want to make this guy smaller, like that. Then what you want to do is you want to basically do that for the other one, the blue one. So I'm going to go ahead and click on the track motion icon of the blue box. And I'm going to make this guy as small as the red one is, like, like so. Then what you want to do is you want to go ahead and place this guy right here. I'm going to put this guy to zero so it's centered. So if I go to the track motion icon, that's this icon that I'm circling over, that one. If you drag it like this, like that, boom. And if you put this one to zero, there are two squares in the screen. Now, if I play back the video, you will just see two solid colors. But you want to imagine that the left uh, red bo uh, box is a video and the blue box is a video. And that's how you do it. That's how you position them. And that's how you play them back at the same time. So that's how you... Um, play videos at the same time. You can do it with 10 videos or 9, 3, um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 videos. I'm looking for some questions, but uh, let's see. How do you do the S shake on Vegas Pro 15? I'm not, I'm not even too sure if I have that one. Um, let me let me see. Um, do I have these S shake? I don't really think I have. No. I don't really have that plug in, so I might look into that. So. Yeah, people say like if I, I created that video um, a while ago, where like where I made a video how to make this text shake or the screen shake something like that, and people say, dude, just use the S underscore shake effect. But I don't really have that one, so I cannot use it. So I had to do it my own way. Guys, I want to thank you for watching. Thank you for the continued support. I'll catch you guys obviously um, not upcoming Sunday, but the Sunday after that. Let, let, let me check how, what kind of what December that is. Uh, it's not going to be the 10th, it's going to be the 17th of December. Um, I will see you guys then because I want to thank you for the support as well. For all the questions, for all the suggestions. And obviously, um, I'm not too sure how I'm going to stream with like the holidays. Like Christmas and New Year. Uh, like New Year, like 2018. I'm not sure how I'm going to uh, go ahead and stream on Sunday, you know. I'm not usually going to do that. So I'm going to see you guys on the 17th of December. Uh, that's that's just in two weeks from now. So I'll see you guys obviously on the 17th. Just Alex Halford.